Hey guys, and welcome to the Wilsons part two. We are not going to work with Desmond today. Um, Desmond was just cooking breakfast. It looks like they'll let him finish and then he's gonna go to work. It is a Saturday, so I think we're going to spend the day with one of the kids. And um, I actually think I want it to be Porter. So, um, yeah, let's, I guess we'll go ahead and have the family kind of get like in a better mood, obviously, and then, oh, okay, grumpy much, um, and then we'll go ahead and hang out with Porter, because I feel like we don't really play with him too much, or well, I mean, this is only part two, if you're kind of new to this, and you're wondering, what the hell does she mean, it's only part two, uh, this was my get to work family, but now I've kind of turned it into an all over, like, get to work, get together type thing, so that is what I mean when I say we don't really play with him, um, but we're gonna play with him today. Let's have him grab a serving, get Eli up, and he can grab a serving as well. And Cameron is eating ice cream for breakfast, so that's that's cool. Um, but yeah, you guys really seem to respond well to the first part, so I thought that that was really cool. Um, I had some people say they really liked Cameron's yoga club that I started, so that was pretty cool as well. Oh, she has some club perks. What can we get? Um capacity upgrade well we don't really need that um hmm to do to do to do we already did the energized thing it might be cool to have like some jackets or something because they are like an exercise group let's do track jackets do we get to Represent your club with a stylish track jacket. Once you've purchased it, don't forget to apply it to your club's uniform in the club panel. Um, right here. Mm. Custom. Let's do style and let's do, oh, you can't do like athletic. Hmm. Um, okay, well, let's do a female adult. Okay, so let's check this out. Where are the jackets? Ah, right here. Wait, that's... Oh, you get to put your logo on the back of it, I see. Uh, so this would be their jackets, because they have a rainbow. So that's kind of cute, we could do that. And then, uh, leggings. We'll just make like a simple... Just a simple little, um like exercise type outfit that they can wear oh, I don't like those uh don't like those either maybe just those and let's put just those sure that that works I honestly just wanted to see the jacket so <laughs> all right um, so yeah, they're just eating, and then when they're done eating, we're going to go out on the town with Porter. So I will see you guys then. All right, guys. So I decided to bring both Eli and Porter to the Bluffs because I have not been to this lot yet. doesn't look like there's anybody here, so um, let's have him go swimming. I mean, might as well. Uh, let's have him jump into the pool. Let's do a backflip. And then Eli, um, let's have you just swim some laps, I guess. Let's see, is he gonna make it? Nope, he belly flopped, like totally and completely belly flopped. Um, but yeah, this is the bluffs. So it's just a it's like a pool, like a natural pool inside the ruins. So like, as you can see, there's like broken columns and just some rocks and stuff. And, ooh, there's a bonfire over there. We're gonna have to check that out. That's really cool. And I still have yet to see the Loch Ness Monster, which is apparently somewhere around here, but 
Um, I haven't seen it yet, and I really want to. There's just, like, graffiti. It's really freaking awesome. I love it. Um, but we went to the cafe last time, so I didn't really want to go to the cafe again. I feel like I might have them, like, like obviously any age can go to any venue, but I'm going to have them. Oh, well, look at that. He did it that time. Uh, what am I trying to say? Jeez. Um, I'm going to have them sneak into, like, a pub or a club or something later because we'll pretend, like, obviously... Uh, well, in America, you have to be 21 to drink and to go into clubs. I think other countries are different ages, but in America, it's 21. Aww. So I think we'll just pretend, like, maybe Eli's like, yeah, it'll be so fun. My friends are going to be there. Like, we're going to totally uh, sneak out and we'll pretend to to be 21 and, like, sneak in or whatever. So I thought that that would be kind of fun because Porter is, like, a nerdy kind of, you know, just keeps to himself kind of guy. He, but he's always been kind of jealous of, like, his brother's social ability and his brother's um, just coolness, basically. So maybe Eli's, like, taking him under his wing, like, yeah, let's go do it. And he's like, well, you know, I don't want to, but... I feel like it's going to put me out of my comfort zone, and it might, like, make me cooler, basically, so, not, like, peer pressure, like, he's not peer pressuring him into doing it, but I feel like he would want to do it, because it's something his brother would do, if that makes sense, so, uh, but they're actually getting hungry, so let's have them go to another venue and get some food. All right, they're in their swimsuits, so we gotta fix that, um... Let's change into some... Wait, 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 sir. You need to put on some regular clothes because that is not cute. Uh, he's actually not hungry, but Porter is. So let's order some food uh, for here. Let's get a scone. And then what, what can he do? This is the other um, cafe. Uh, that's just this area is just so awesome like look at that there's like a bridge and watch we can totally walk here and I'm wondering if like these terrain like see how it's raised if, if that's a hint like are we gonna get some terrain thing soon and look at this pigeons there are flippin pigeons just chilling on the street look at that just so cool this is a great expansion pack I love it um let's go see who is in here who are you an adult she looks smaller than the other ones um adult oh adult he's in his mom's club all these people are adults I feel oh well no it's Saturday I feel like there should be teens around somewhere but there really isn't Um, why don't you come order a drink? Let's order a drink for here, and we'll get a mocha. Did Porter eat? Eat that. I think it's someone else's, but you're still hungry. Who's this guy? He looks pretty cool. Marcus Flex. He's in Party House and Powerhouse. Who's this guy? Over here with his little hat. Looking all dapper, Leland. He's going to go talk to Jay and to Alice Spencer Kim. What is Eli doing? Oh, he's over here. Just checking out the cafe until it's time to sneak into the club. We don't want to sneak in there too early because then they'll stand out like a sore thumb. Because... Who's in the club at like 1.30 in the afternoon? Pretty much nobody. But it's kind of cool that Porter's like trying to get out of his comfort zone. He's like bored. He's super bored. But he's like trying to talk to new people and trying to be, trying to be more sociable. Have him come use the bathroom. Alright. He's all done in there. I think she's an adult. Yeah, she is. We need some more teens. Are you a teen? No. Are you a teen? No. 
Are you a teen? He's a full beard, so probably not so much a teen. Um, it's getting later, though. It's getting later. <laughs> Guess we'll just let them talk and stuff until they can go out and have fun instead of being bored here. All right, it's starting to get dark outside, so they decided it was time to head to the nightclub, which still looks pretty empty, but we'll pretend it's not. And they they just wanted to come here and party, so let's have them dance. Let's dance together. Oh, there's some people starting to come in here. Oh, there's a downstairs level? Nice. You could see it through the dance floor. Oh, there we go. It's starting to fill up. These little sneaky boys snuck out to the dance club. Not sure how their mom will feel about that, but that's okay. Looks like they're having fun. Porter looks like he's never had this much fun in his life. Um... So basically, the reason I wanted to bring them to the club is because I wanted to expose Porter to, like, this, the DJ music and just the atmosphere, because I think we're going to have Mr. Nerdy Scientist Porter become a DJ, because why not? Like, maybe he came here with his brother. That's exactly what happened, actually. He came here with his brother, and he thought that it was awesome, and he got really into it, and built his own DJ booth and started DJing at home and when he's a young adult he'll be ready for the DJ world but I saw that Eli has to go to the bathroom which I think is upstairs um, I don't know if they're like male or female they're not the best dancers in the world but that's okay Um, I was hoping somebody here would be like a, uh, what are they called? Spin Master? Because I would really like to get Porter in the Spin Masters at some point in the future. That would be awesome. But he's actually getting hungry again, so let's go ahead up to the bar. I thought it was upstairs. Oh, it's downstairs. My bad. Um, and let's have him... Oh. Well... Oh, it's almost Haley's birthday. Yay. We can make her a cake when we get home, too. Might as well age her up. We are not on any restrictions. Where is the flippin' bartender? Because he is hungry. What is he doing? He's just watching. He's, like, enthralled by it. Look at him. He's like, this is so awesome. Let's have him talk to Paolo here. Ask about day. Tell a joke about ducks and tell a funny story. And a heartfelt compliment. Is there a bartender here yet? Okay, there is. Let's order food. I think that there's awesome. You can order all kinds of food now. Olives, bread rolls, currywurst, fish and chips, french fries, meat and cheese, pita and hummus, uh, pretzels, and chips. Let's get hummus because I love hummus. It's so good. Whoa, whoa. Wait, you did what now? Oh my god, you can get DJ skill from watching other DJs. That is so cool. That is super cool, actually. What does it say? Bumpin' beats. This DJ was spinning vibrant beats, and the dance mood was on fire. Looks like Eli's back at it, too. He's like, oh, yeah. The bartender's like, you are not 21. <laughs> uh, let's have him order um, some bread rolls. Wait, dude. Oh, it's like multiple servings? Well, then get that. Don't waste money. God, I could go for some pita. There is a Greek shop in my local town, and they make the best homemade pita and hummus. It has, like, lemon in it, and it is so good. Mm. I could go for some right now. I have not eaten lunch yet, and it's 3.30, so... 
That could be why I'm so hungry. Whoa, 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 whoa. Wait a minute here. That is... That is the leader of the Spin Masters. Forget the food and come talk to this guy. Um, get to know him. Share photos with him. Heartfelt compliment. We need to get into this club. Brighten his day. Ooh, he's getting crazy. Let's get to know this guy. So that way when Porter gets good with the uh, DJ skill, he can get into the Spin Masters. Brighten day. Talk about the Spin Masters. Ask about day. Tell a gross joke. What are you doing? Talk to him. Tell a funny story. Oh, they're watching him. Get to know him and talk about Spin Masters. Ask about day. I don't know. I really like this whole little story I set up, though, because it's so believable. Because he got a skill point just from watching her. And then he met this guy there, and he's like, yeah, I'm a DJ, too. And it's just, like, it just seems so real, like, how someone would get into something. Like, DJing. So, I really like it. And I think that it's going to be a lot of fun. I considered making Haley the DJ, but then I was like, you know what? No. We're going to make Porter the DJ. We're going to make him do something that you wouldn't think he would do. I don't even know where Eli is. Oh, well, look at you. She's, like, way older than him, but he's talking to her. He's like, yeah, not anymore. It's almost Eli's birthday. Two days. Oh, man. Let's go talk. Singles night at the bar. Let's go out and meet someone new. Um, you know what? Sure. And let's bring Porter here. I feel like that's something that happens, like, when you're out and then one of your friends texts you and is like, hey, like, let's come over here. Uh, it's singles night. That means that flirty sims can buy each other drinks on the cheap. So it is singles night. So let's see who is here. The DJ guy came. Um, Irene Fuller, Shannon, so a bunch of adults, but they think that these guys are young adults, so it, it's fine. We'll just, we won't flirt with anybody, but we will come and get to know this guy. And then Eli, although she's kind of cute though, isn't she? Who are you? You're pretty cute. Jade Rosa. Let's let's talk to her because he's gonna be a young adult soon, so he can he can start scoping out the ladies. Irene Fuller. Whereas Porter's just trying to get in with this guy so that he can join. This guy's not single. Um, so he can join the Spin Masters though. Let's tell an outrageous story and show off outfits, although he probably won't like it. Um, complain about everything. That's so funny. Ask about day. Ask about career. Tell a joke about penguins. Tell a dramatic story. Who's this? Gretchen Leach. That's a funny name. Um, who are you, Irene? And you're married, too, to that guy, actually, right there. Focused. Uh, let's let's tell a joke about vampires and talk about art, because he is into photography, so he's a, a bit of an artist. Uh, tell a funny story, brighten her day. Uh, let's not complain about parents, because we're not trying to let everybody know. Porters learn that Dominic is an entertainer at Limelight. Let's compliment her outfit, even though she's dressed like a bartender. <laughs> Can we ask about her interests? Like, get to know, and then discuss interests. Porter, they're starting to get tired, so we're going to have to go home pretty soon. Plus, it's getting late, so their mom would probably be like, um, 
what are you guys doing? Like, where are you? Eli's like, oh, we're just at a friend's house studying, Mom. It's fine. And she's like, mm, mm-hmm. Yeah, I don't, I don't really believe that at all. And she's like a detective, so she's like, why do I hear bar music and, and drinks rattling in the background? And he's like, no reason. No reason at all. We're just watching TV. Yeah, she's not an idiot. I don't know. They're getting along pretty well. Um, does he know anything about her, really, though? She is neat, ambitious, and outgoing. Hmm. She might be a potential love interest for him, because she's pretty cute, and he seems interested in her. Let's tell a funny story, and tell an outrageous story, and just be hilarious. Go check on Porter over here. Uh, Porter looks like he's over it. Well, well, we'll go ahead and go home because uh, we want to age up Haley anyways. And they've been out like all day. So I will see you guys shortly. All right, guys. I had um, Cameron make a birthday cake for little Haley. And we're going to have her come and make a wish and blow out the candles. And she will be a teen, and we can start having some fun with her in Windenburg as well. I feel like Windenburg is so perfect for, like, teens and young adults. Really? Okay, try again. Make a wish. And Haley's adopted, so I'm really interested to see what she's going to look like when she ages up. All right, so let's pick a treat for her. Um, you know what? Let's give her the leader of the pack because that's a new um, aspiration, not trait. That's a new aspiration that came with Get Together. And let's also give her Dance Machine because that's new. And if she's active, chances are she's going to like dancing too. So let's get a better look at her. Well, I mean, this is not a very good angle. Oh my goodness, she's so pretty. I mean, she's making like the least attractive face ever right now, but she is so pretty. Aw. Very pretty, Sim. All right, guys, um, I'm going to go ahead and call it a part here. I'll give Haley a makeover. We will actually, we'll go ahead and buy Porter a... Uh, DJ booth right now because he was so interested that he went ahead and built himself one out of stuff that he had because he's a scientist and he can do that and we're not questioning it or anything at all. Right guys? No questioning. Um, let's do let's do green. So we'll just um, he doesn't need a bookcase in his room I guess. He has one why is my mouse getting stuck? Hmm. I'm going to have to clean it. But yeah, here is his little DJ area. I feel like it would just be over in the corner. We'll move these plants over here. We'll just sell that one. But yeah, there's his little DJ booth. Had an extra laptop and built the stuff and bought some things and made his own little DJ booth so he can practice his stuff. So yeah, it should be lots of fun and I will give Haley a makeover and redo her room and I will see you guys in the next part. As always, thanks for watching and I will talk to you guys next time. Bye everybody.